board, which is SL delta L plus SK delta K equals delta Y. Again, you can think about that as like a first order approximation to the production function, right? There's nothing in that approximation that says that these shares are constant, that they don't vary with output, right? There's no, you don't need that. This is a first order approximation to the production function. Now, of course, it's more than a first order approximation if we happen to have Cobb Douglas, because then this is like, a, this is the Cobb Douglas production function. If you measure everything in logs and you have, then these are just the coefficients that are in the Cobb Douglas production function, right? So, but more generally, it's a first order approximation to the production function. And it's derived simply from assuming that each input's getting paid its marginal product, right? That's all we needed for that. We then also had SL delta W plus SK delta R has to be equal to delta P. That's a first order approximation to the cost function assuming constant returns to scale. Now that's important. This one actually doesn't assume constant returns to scale. It's just that these shares won't necessarily add up to one if you didn't have constant returns to scale. They might be different, they might not sum to one. But this one does assume constant returns to scale. If you don't have constant returns to scale, this, this equation is going to change. It's going to change in two really significant ways. One is these shares will no longer be shares, they'll be marginal shares. They'll be shares in which these factors are used on the margin, okay? And then there'll be a Y term because if you don't have constant returns to scale, then changes in output will change marginal cost. That's absent with constant returns to scale. So the constant returns to scale assumption really does two things. One, it makes marginal factor shares equal to average factor shares, right? You use inputs on the margin the same way you use them on average. And for pricing, it's always about marginal factor shares. On the other hand, it also assumes that the marginal cost is independent of output. So you get both of those when you have. Now, if you had homothetic, everybody knows what homothetic production means? What's the difference between constant returns to scale and homothetic? Basic, the answer is with homothetic, you still have all the same isoquants, they're just not numbered the same way, right? That is, the isoquants are still all radial blow-ups of one another. They just aren't necessarily proportional to how far you are from the origin, right? That's the big difference with homothetic. And you can see that in the cost function, right? We said CRS, I'm going to get a cost function that looks like Y times C of W R and one, right? That is, that's going to be my, that's a CRS cost function, just right off the bat, okay? Homothetic looks like G of Y, C of W, R, and one. You know, it looks like that. That's homothetic. That is, it looks, looks like this one, except for this isn't a linear anymore. It's not, it's not linear. That would be a homothetic cost function, okay? But anyway. So let's say this is all based on, so this one is definitely needs CRS here. Okay. Then our, our next equation was delta Y equals elasticity of demand delta P. That's just saying we're just going to move along the industry demand curve. That was our third equation. And then finally, we had the substitution equation. And for the substitution equation, we said it was delta L minus delta K equals sigma delta R minus delta W, which works in the two-factor case because with two factors, relative quantities are just a function of relative prices, right? That's true CRS. It's also actually true for homothetic. That formula would still be true with homothetic production. Okay, and sigma is a measure of the elasticity of substitution, and it's a positive number because we have L versus K here and K versus L on this side, right? We, we, we flipped it around, okay? Any questions that people, people have about that?
people see how that works. 